To other matters, the Abia State Governor, Alex Oti, has condemned the influence of money in Nigerian political system. The governor spoke at the National Conference of the Nigerian Bar Association Section on Public Interest and Development Law in Lagos. Kemi Foladeyemo has more. When you win an election and it is stolen and you go to the judiciary, which should be the last hope of the common man, and then money again shows up to further cement the stealing, then you have no hope. And I've gone through this, and I know how it feels. About 346 justices in Nigeria are hearing petitions that arose from the 2023 general election. Observers say this final stage of the electoral process has far-reaching implications, including the potential to affirm or obtain the victory or defeat of candidates at the polls. Are we going to kill a willing horse with so much work? keep on driving matters to the few judges that are available. And then all the other matters that are pending in their own courts, for the next six months, they are not seeing the light of day. Under our law, criminal cases, human rights cases, state president, in law, over other matters. But today, election petition, six months. Other cases, many years. Stop. The speakers advocate that all future election petitions must be concluded before swearing in as a way to ensure the sanctity of the electoral process. In its present form, and nothing to do with the chair, it's not his fault. They are overwhelmed with a lot of things. So the only way we can begin to talk about proper elections in 2027 is to reform, is to first of all unbundle it. Must be unbundled. When technology is used more, that it reduce the number of witnesses. Why we begin to take all longer time and other is because we want witnesses to come and prove. You have to prove. Whoever alleges must prove. But if it is issue of technology, digitization of all the process, it's only documentary. So we don't need all the witnesses. While calling for more activism and capacity of members of the bench. These stakeholders say lawyers who contribute to the subversion of justice in Nigeria shall be punished. Kemi Foladiemo, TVC News, Lagos.